In this video, we will discuss requests for admission. In a request for admission, a party is basically saying, look, admit this is true now, so we don't have to waste time proving it later. Requests for admission are part of the discovery process where parties to a civil litigation obtain and disclose information prior to trial. Requests for admission are special because their primary purpose is to save time. They are intended to speed up the litigation. In a request for admission, one party to a civil litigation asks the other party to admit certain things are true. The other party can be asked to admit facts, the application of law to facts, and the genuineness of documents. So let's say we have David and we have Patty. And Patty is suing David for negligence. Patty is alleging that on February 2nd, David crashed his blue car into her car. Furthermore, she alleges that on February 3rd, David sent her an email from his David Triple Z at Yahoo.com account. And in this email, David admitted that he crashed into her car and that he was very sleepy at the time. Now, there are a bunch of things that Patty's going to want to prove at trial. She'll want to prove that David was driving the blue car. She'll probably want to prove that David sent that email. And all of this is going to take time. Requests for admission could speed things up for her. First, she could ask David to admit that he was driving that blue car on February 2nd. If it's true, David will probably have to admit that. He'll have to say, yes, it's true, I was driving that blue car. Otherwise, David will deny the request for admission, and Patty will have to prove it at trial. Next, Patty may ask David to admit that his email address is davidtriplez at yahoo.com. And she could also ask David to admit that he sent that email on February 3rd. If David admits that he was driving the blue car and that he sent that email on February 3rd, well, good for Patty and good for our legal system because now Patty doesn't have to prove this at trial. It's already admitted to be true. If you'd like to discuss requests for admission or any other matter related to U.S. law, stop on my website where I've got some quizzes, some flashcards, a blog, and a brand new message board.